big data, we're getting more and more of this in microbiology, especially in the field of omics, where we have a wealth of data from genomics, proteomics, transcriptomics, and beyond. But what to do with all these little pieces of omics data that we can perhaps think of like these bricks? You know, how do you sort through the data to find commonalities? How do you find your particular piece of data you need to address your hypothesis? I'm Gail Teitzel, editor of Trends in Microbiology, and our themed review issue on omics fulfilling the promise aims to address questions like these as to how we can really get the most that we can from omics. Some examples of how omics has been applied in microbiology in this issue include making sense of diversity, understanding functional capabilities, and genome changes, as well as infectious disease surveillance and forensic epidemiology. In addition, some articles explore how omics can be best paired with classical microbiological techniques, including culturing, phylogeny, and biochemistry, in order to really enrich the insights that we can gain from this data. I hope you'll join us and explore the articles in this issue to see how omics can be used to build a better picture of the microbiological world.